I've defeated the mechs and I've defeated the slime. And now I'm here for the fish. In this video, I'm going to be attempting to beat Duke Fish Run with completely pre-hard mode attainable gear. Quick ground rules, no fledgling wings because they're way too rare. No brain of confusion because it saves you from too many hits. And I'm letting myself use the star cannon, but I'm only allowing myself 100 stars because I felt like that was a reasonable amount for a player to have that they would also be willing to spend. Let's go! Alright. So, step one is to just fight it like this. And then fi and then after I die, I'm gonna figure out like, what do I feel like I need? Like, where do I want a another platform? Like, do I wanna have stairs here? Basically, I'm gonna figure all of that out like slowly as I go. And now Duke Fishron is a fight with no time limit. So I could potentially, uh, use molten armor if I feel like I need the defense. I'm not really sure how much damage he's going to be doing. This is by far one of the fights, um, one of the fights I have the least experience with in this game. Alright, so let's see like what the hell happens. This dash stuff is not, like, the hardest in the world, but I can see he's catching me, like, here and there. And that's probably gonna be a problem. So definitely some sort of... Ah, oh, that was fun. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Hey, takeaways. After after using this setup for so long, right? I'm finding that like it's not that difficult to dodge most of this stuff. But I get in I'm getting in like pickles. Like you think another platform, but like Okay, first of all, I want to try it with like normal rows of platforms. I don't think that's great though. Okay, I'm just gonna add one extra bro and see like what that does. Like I, I feel like during the fight, what's gonna end up happening is I'm just gonna go to the top platform anyway, and then it's just gonna be the same thing. But I guess I always have the option to go down now at this point. Like maybe a row of two, and then I do another row of two, but like higher up, like more separated. So then instead of standing on that like flat, on the like sand surface where I have nowhere to drop down, like I can drop down from here if I need to. I got caught with something there. I was watching that tornado to see if it was gonna... Like, I need to find a way to not get in that situation. I think I definitely like the second platform, because there's like no reason not to have it, because it's just the same as having the flat ground, but now I have the option to go down. There's no reason not to have that. I could do stairs? I think stair- because you go upstairs so quickly, like I definitely think it would be valuable. Okay, I almost have this crazy idea. Like, if I dash and then go, like, upstairs, I need to make sh make it sure so that, like, I can do other, like, 
di I'm gonna have diagonally up into the left stairs and then diagonally up into the right stairs and I'm gonna see if I can like t like space it out so that I can just dash up and then dash up again or like maybe I just have stairs and I don't even have a, like a top platform because then like what if I get up here and then I can like go like way above and then around and all I have to do is just make sure that I'm on the edge. And then I'll even uh, continue these for down here as well. The sword might actually come in handy. Like, if all the bubbles are coming at me, like, what if I switch the sword? I'm just, I'm just gonna leave that like that for now, and I'm gonna try and use that and see, like, what it kind of does for me. Like, they're, they're like shielding him, bro. Like, okay, I think it's tornado time, right? Nope? Okay. Okay, that seems like okay. But then, like, the after I get to the top, I start going, like, very slow. Are these NATOs, bro? I know they're coming. Whoa! This is so awesome. I love this so much. This is exactly the kind of thing I was looking for. I like these stairs. But I can't ascend off of them after I'm done going up. So to me, that means I need taller stairs. Or a different thing that can make me ascend higher and I cannot possibly think of what that would be that would let me ascend from the ground more quickly because here's the annoying thing like if I use all of that up and then I go onto the horse and then I leave the horse I don't get it back so like I, I terrace bar I'm horse I jump I let go and I don't get to do it again I have to be touching the ground with my own character's feet before it gives it back to me. I'm gonna leave that there for now because I don't wanna bother getting rid of it. But I'm going to try to get like much taller stairs going. And I'm gonna try, like what if I make like a diagonal over here? And it's just like a bunch of rows of diagonal stairs. Like not quite sure how that would do, but. Like, what if I have this random diagonal staircase that goes really high for no reason? And I'm like, I'm down here now. That didn't seem that helpful. It's really the tornadoes that are the problem. And that's the only thing. Like, these dashes are so fine. The bubbles are like able to be dealt with, but it's the NATOs, bro, it's the NATOs. Oh. Don't ask what happened there, because I have a... I hope the tornadoes spawn over to the right there. Nope, they're spawning right there. Okay. That's like.
Where are these things? I know they're right over here. No Terra Spark. I had no Terra Spark, but I can do this. Oof, that hit me. I did not expect that. I frame Andy? Oh, I just went through. Hey, my, like, timing for this stuff is off, but... Damn, that was good. You see? It can be done. Apparently, I need, like, an escape route. And, like, what if I just had the same thing, but again? Just in a different spot? <laughs> I keep- I guess I'm holding down, that's why I'm not going up. Oh. Down, down here. Two, three, four, five. Oh, I thought I'd get up first. Heave through there. The Ark of the Shark. This fight is so sick. I love how they designed these little dashes. They were despawning. Okay, there's definitely tornadoes on the left down there. I think I'm getting I wanted to go up. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. You know what I did? I held, I deliberately held up because I was like, I need to go up the stairs. But then in holding up, I stopped holding to the right. It's not gonna hit me, right? Yeah, it's gonna hit me. I gotta, I gotta do a better job of keeping track of the pattern. Because if I just knew exactly what he would do next, rather than trying to react every time, that would help so much. Because I wasn't sure if I should have kept moving, because I thought he might still be dashing, or if like, but he, he just stopped. Basically. I just want to keep going. Cause that was fun as hell. I don't have time, I have to go to school. Fuck you, bird. I'll do another one. Oh. oh, and I have three more fallen stars than I should, that I haven't even been using. I'm gonna save that for, like, final phase, that makes the most sense, right?
Why have I stopped firing? Why did I stop? Stuck between a tornado and a duke place. Why do you grapple? I didn't do that. I just froze myself. Like that's, if I do this, sometimes I just go through, it's like. Like why did I go through right there? So immediately, I think I'm gonna extend this a, just a little higher because it's faster for me to just keep going up than it is for me to like stop and then jump. So like I'm basically building in that jump automatically by just having the option to go higher on the staircase. And then from here, I definitely, I like that there's this drop. Because there's, th there's just this opportunity to let gravity like, take you down as fast as you can basically. I should, um, what if I do this, build a third layer, just more options to go in different directions, I think, is the best thing that I can have. If I jump when it's a staircase, do I just go up? Why don't I go up? If you come at it from a forward angle, rather than like landing on top, you just go through. These things are gone by now, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. He's 
bubbles! These bubbles! What did what happen? I guess I pressed down. Feral Bite? Why? Bro, what if you get confused? I wish I was hoping that thing would go away. I was, okay. I think there's tornadoes down here, which is why, what I'm kind of worried about. See, if I knew that he was done dashing, I think there's tornadoes in my path. I guess they'd be typhoons or something. Water tornado. Whirlpool. There shouldn't be any up here. Dash. All right, here we are.
No, no, no. Oh, wrong platform, bro. Up here. Get enraged for like one second. Okay, he like swerved into me. There's one here! It's gone! Now that you've seen the first fight where I got it to phase two, I'm going to start cutting things down a lot more because it takes a long time just to do one fight and I know you don't want to see all of that. The battle shall be legendary. Oh. So if I come up here, there shouldn't be one there. Sneak under there. Alright, what happened? Oh, that's not right. Oh. Up the stairs, no. Up the stairs, no. Okay. That was so lame. Oh. Don't get hit by that, and I didn't luckily. Ooh, I couldn't tear a spark, and my guy was just hovering in front. Ooh, I didn't know he was still dashing, bro. Be nice if I could fucking see him off the fucking screen, yeah. Nice. It's not very uh generous with these dashes at anymore. Hmm. He turns so last second. It's so annoying. Oh, that's not good. I thought he was still dashing, bro. I don't know why my audio goes quiet. Uh, by the way. Go to that side. Be nice if these things stop existing. That would be very close. Don't hit me. The bubble hit me though, and that's gonna hit me. No, why did you come at the same angle that I was moving? That hurts! Why does that hurt me? Why does that have a box? Why? Fuck! I should've just kept running! That was in my way! There's no way I could've known it was gonna be in my way! Oh, dash! I don't think I can dash while I trap. No! Stop! Dude! Oh shit. I'm looping back into a tornado, I think. No, don't grapple to war, just grapple up. Oh. Holy crap! Three, four. That was not four. Fuck! No, no, get off of the fucking horse. Oh, 
Oh, nope. I mean, this is... I didn't like why would that be that high up? Oh my god. I'm googling this because I actually have to know when the fuck does the next phase start? No! 11,000. I have to outlast that for so long. No. no, there. Why? How am I supposed to anticipate that? So at this point, I had developed a system where, for phase one, I would have a damage loadout consisting of necro armor and menacing on all of my accessories, and in phase two, I would have a defensive loadout consisting of molten armor with warding on all of my accessories. So, um. I have, so for phase one, I have a damage setup, and I've keybinded it um, so that I can just switch them like quickly, so when I go to phase two, I'll go to my defense setup, so this way I just get to you know, do this faster. Um, also, I've swapped out the stinger necklace in phase two for a frog gear, hoping that the movement uh, of that will help me, help my survivability. But yeah, I mean, this just goes so much faster when I have the damage. We wouldn't even be anywhere near here if I had my defense level. Oh, and I had a buff. I, I, I don't understand. I'm just falling, and then all of a sudden there's sharks, and I don't know how to not get hit by that. And what, I mean, what can you blame me? I gotta go down at some point. I'm getting too high up. I... No, I was shield of Cthulhu dashing. What? What? Health isn't low enough. Oh, I'm down here now. Stairs. Oh. Mm -mm. So at this point, I did a little bit more of an arena expansion, although I don't have any footage of it. I added another staircase at the bottom that goes up and to the left, and then I added another one at the top that goes up and to the right. So now it's like almost mirrored on both sides. Not like exactly, but basically, functionally, it's like the same on both sides. Did not think that's how that would interact. Oh, but I go up. Yeah, I guess it depends on like which direction I hold, I guess. Yeah. Oh. No, I was going up. That can that thing stop being there now? Very lucky.
Hey, maybe this arena isn't better. Maybe it's, I just ruined it. It almost, I mean, the arena almost doesn't even really make any difference. It doesn't seem to, like, matter. Oh, is this, a uh, phase two? I believe so. He's gonna start. Let's not get hit by the random bubbles. Up here, up here, up here, up here, up here. That thing terrified me. Good thing I was moving because that was going to hit me. Struck down before the sharks become a problem while I'm falling. Except now they're gonna hit me on the way up here, I think. Self going under sucks.
Oh no. Let's make sure that we actually go up this time. There we go. Oh, like a bunch of my boss just went away. I just realized. Alright, shoot this. You. This is so bullshit. What? What? It, uh, what? What did you do? Bro, I'm gonna have to watch the footage back on that one because I can't fucking get there again in like fucking two seconds and do it again. That is so infuriating. Because I feel like, for one, whenever I watch, because I, like I've never. Fought Duke Fishron in expert mode or higher while I like at the point in progression where I was supposed to, so I've never ever had to actually deal with that part of the fight like properly. But from what I see, it's pretty damn simple. I mean, as long as you dash and move either up or down, you get out the damn way, correct? So why ain't that happening? And also... Is that simply because I don't have enough movement? Am I being movement fucked right there? What damn options do I have? You know what? Maybe I can make a third loadout. Yeah, and I saw I saw a video because I, I was doing a little research, right? Because I don't know what that phase is like, and it was like, oh, he, you know, he does one dash from one side, and then he'll go like whichever side he ended on, he'll start the next thing on the opposite, and then he'll do two, and then he'll do three, and then he'll repeat. But I swear he started with more than one. Like maybe I was just so far away that. I have an idea. 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 Oh shit, no no no, not th not now. He delays it, he delays so long sometimes. So what you've just watched up to now is however many hours of footage this is, and then that's not counting the fact that I basically did that, but again, because that's just how long it took. Eventually, I came up with a strategy which involves a third loadout, which focuses on both offense and defense, where it gives me a lot of regeneration with like the band of regeneration and stinger necklace, but everything is reforged to menacing so that I can kill the boss quickly so I don't risk dying. I also had the plan to recall pot to a little room where basically I would get away from all the extra projectiles left over from phase two and just be able to focus on the boss in phase three. And I would use the shield of Cthulhu to do that like shield bash strategy and hope that I don't get hit too much and die. This is how that went.
I didn't switch to my uh, loadout that I have set up for that, but yeah, it doesn't really make any difference. Phase 1, for some reason, I feel like it's harder to... Like, it's easier, but it's harder to get into, like, a pattern that you like. Like, there's more, I feel like, variables. The success of that attempt really, like, made me optimistic about this. I keep thinking it's phase two. I mean, phase two is the like way scarier one. So I, mean, I can't really play myself.
Okay, phase two. I was just... Oh my goodness. That was actually timed very well. I didn't realize I was out of stars. I just like just so happened to like do that at the right time. Shield of Cthulhu moment. Uh, Shield of Cthulhu moment again. That's very early. That's actually bad. Look what I got away with it.
One, two, three. One, one, two, 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 one, two, three. One, one, two. 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 One, two. Zombie, give me a hug. Oh shit, he's dead. Give me a hug. Give me a hug. Hug me. Yes! Oh my god. I don't have to do that ever again. Now that I've just completed that challenge, I have a challenge for you. I challenge you to just try, just try to tolerate more of my god-awful videos by hitting that subscribe button. Bet you can't do it. <laughs>